Olivier again, and I am here with another 24 minute workout for you. So, before we talked about, we were gonna start with 24, so 24 minutes of activity. I am going to continue to give you 24 total workouts, 24 minutes long each. You're gonna get a variety of different things in each of these workouts. So for today, we're gonna to focus on a full body strengthening, specifically working back strengthening, legs and arms. So those are the bigger major muscles that we need to work through, we think about working through in our workouts. So for today, you can have a water bottle, you can have a hand weight. So my hand weight is a five pound. Typically I would use probably a three pound when I'm doing upper body stuff. So with the lighter upper body weight stuff, I may use the water bottle just for a little bit of resistance as we go through. And then maybe as we work through with heavier stuff, I'll go with the heavier weight. We're gonna work through 24 minutes. We're gonna start with a warm up. And on our warm up, we're gonna go through everything, all of the exercises that we're going to be doing, we're gonna do them with no resistance. So as we move through and we add in a little bit of the weight for resistance and for strength, you don't have to add in the weights at all. You take it where you need to. So we're gonna start with the feet wide, shoulders back and down. Again, we're taking it nice and easy here. I'm gonna to come to a little squat, right arm punch. Squat, left arm punch, down and up. So range is smaller here. And all we're working through is getting the blood flowing. And then I want you to think about each of the movements as we move through. Give me four. Three, two, and one. Next time, squat, little overhead press. Squat down, overhead press. Down, lift, drop, lift. Give me four, three, Last two. Now, if you need music to motivate you through, by all means, make your favorite playlist and listen to your music. We're gonna go with a bicep curl, overhead press, back in. So notice I curl up, rotate the hands, punch toward the ceiling, pull down and in and down. So we're working through the motion here, through the wrist, through the shoulders, in, press, down, open up. Good, give me three, two, and one. Now, right leg is gonna step forward and we're gonna work on a reverse fly. So my feet are hip width apart, arms come straight out to the side and back down. So I can look forward as long as my spine stays nice and long and in alignment. Four, three. So that means if you feel like you're having a bend through the neck to lift, then keep the head tilt tucked under, switch legs. We've got eight, seven, brace through the core, belly pulled in. Yes. drop down, one row up. Drop, and then lift the arms. So I keep that downward movement and that upward movement. Drop, and pull up. Four, three, two, and then we're gonna switch legs, and switch. Belly in, drop, and lift, press down. Almost like you're punching down towards the floor as you come into that lunge. Drop and lift. Give me four, three, two, and one. Nice job, we're gonna step right leg forward again. And this time I'm gonna come into a tricep kickback. So I'm gonna bring the elbows up from this side. Elbows to about shoulder height. Just press straight back and pull in. Back and pull in. So I want the arms going straight back, back and in. We've got four, three, two. So
So we're working for the muscle contraction. Switch legs, keep the arms going. So the weights as we add in are strictly up to you if you decide you want to use them. We've got four, three, two, and one. Little back release, press across and across, over and over. So notice, opposite leg, I come up on the toes and I lift the heel as I rotate through. I'm pressing across with the arm, but I'm not doing a lot of twists through the back. I wanna keep the back nice and strong. Shoulders and hips move in the same direction. We've got four, three, two, and one. Next time, we're gonna squat down and just push down and up. I've got it, down and then right there, drop and lift. Have to work that coordination, down and up, down and up. So we've got four more on this side, working through the arms. So I get my arms and legs working together. One more, and switch sides. Down, up, down, up. So if you choose to use the weights, we can add a little pause in to switch the weight over. Three, last two, and one. Good, just shake out through the arms, through the legs. I'm gonna take my water bottle for the first round. This is gonna be my resistance through. So we're gonna keep it here. We're gonna be pressing across the body. So one squat down and punch, down and punch. I'm keeping the water bottle in my right hand. When we come through the next set, we're gonna focus on the left side. Down, press, down, press. Give me four, three, two, and one, we go into that squat down, squat down, overhead press. Now you can use weights in both hands if you choose, down and up. But again, I'm using this more for the tiny bit of resistance. Drop, lift, two, and one. Good. Now I have that bicep curl, overhead press, down and press, small curl, press up. So if you have the weights in each hand, you can just do the right hand here if you choose, so we get more of that rotation. Give me three, two, and one. Good. Working into the back muscles again. Right leg comes forward, arms out to the side. Water bottle or weight in the right hand, both hands if you choose. We lift and lower. So I want you to squeeze your shoulder blades together at the top. Squeeze, release. Four, three, two, and one. Good, we're gonna switch legs. We're gonna keep the weight in the same arm, right hand. Four, three, two. Give me four more sets here. Squeeze, release, squeeze, release. Good, now back to the right leg lunge. And we're gonna add in that row. So we come down and we lift. Press down, row up, drop, lift, drop, and lift. Again, for four, good. Keeping the shoulders right over your hips, feeling the back leg working. We've got two more. One more time, we're gonna switch legs. We're gonna keep the weight in the right hand unless you're working both arms. So we come down and we row up. Press down, your core is engaged. Belly button pulled in towards your spine. 
press and lift. Again, we've got four, three, last two, and one. Right leg comes forward again. We're gonna go into that tricep kickback. So I'm gonna lift the elbows up about shoulder height, squeeze them in towards you. Push back, pull in, push back, pull in. Your belly is nice and tight, pulled into your spine. We've got four, three, two, and one. We switch legs, keep the arms going. Eight here, seven, six, five, four, nice and strong, belly in, two, and one. We go into that back release. So just that press across, press across, left to the right, left hand to the right side, right hand to the left side, releasing through the back. So I'm twisting my hips and my shoulders go in the same direction, four, three, two, and one. I'm gonna change up this squat just a little. We drop and lift, drop and lift. Give me two more here. Water bottle's in the right hand, right hand to left foot. So we drop and lift, drop and lift, down and up. So we're working the arms, the back, and the legs. Four, three, Last two, and one. Shake it out. We're gonna switch that water bottle over to the left hand, and we're gonna do that set again. So we're gonna start with the punches. Right arm's gonna come across first, but now I have a little bit of weight and resistance into the left hand. So down and punch, down and punch. Now, this round, can you pull your belly in a little tighter? Drop and punch, drop and punch. We've got four, three, two, and one. Squat, overhead press. Squat down, overhead press. Now you can use the hands together here if you choose, kind of like we did on the last round. Down and press. Down and press. Drop. Lift, down, and up. Give me two more, drop, and lift. And then we're gonna have that bicep curl overhead. You can keep the weight between both hands, or curl, twist, press up, and back down. In, twist, press, back in, twist, and down. Lift. Nice work. So really focus on your form. So again, you don't have to have any type of resistance here. Press up. Give me two more. Last time. We're gonna step the right leg forward, left leg back, reverse fly. That water bottle and weight stays in the left arm. Lift and lower. So a little squeeze at the top. Lift and lower, lift and lower. Your belly is pulled in. You're working nice and strong. Four, three, we keep the movement going, but we're gonna switch through the legs. Switch, lift, lift, lower, lift and lower. Four more, core in tight. Jaw relax, last two. Good, now we take it to that lunge. Right leg forward, press everything down and row up the body. Press down, row up. How we doing? Lift, a little more intense than the warm up. Adding in some resistance or just being more intentional. We've got four, three, two, and 
we're gonna switch legs. Lift, left leg comes back, or left, right leg comes back, left leg forward, down, and lift. Press down, and lift. So I'm really trying to push into my feet as I go down. Evenly through the front foot, through the toes of the back foot, because the back heel is lifted. Four more. Your belly is pulled in, your spine is long. Last two. We're gonna keep the lunge going with the legs, and we're gonna switch sides. We're gonna come into that tricep press, shoulders round back, elbows up. Kick back, tricep kick back, back and in, back and in. So the spine stays long, again from the side, press back, pull in. Trying to keep my shoulders, or my elbows at shoulder height. Two more. Good, step through, switch legs, keep that tricep going, press back and in. So give me a little chin tuck, so you're not hiking through the neck. We've got four, three, two, we're gonna take it into that back release. Make sure hips go in the same direction. Left arm presses to the right, right arm to the left. Straight across and over, over and back, over and back. Nice, we've got four, three, you were expecting a count in between there, right? Two, we're working both sides of the body, we're working good. And last one, now four squats down and up, because we have to think about that movement. Now next time we come down, lift. Left arm towards the right knee, the right shin, four, three, two, and one. Shake it out, take a little breath. Whew. All right, I'm gonna switch out my water bottle for my hand weight. We're gonna go back through, focusing on the right side, then we're gonna focus through on the left side. So if you feel like, mm, I'm gonna stick with the water bottle or I don't need any resistance, then you don't have to have any at all. If you feel like you can incorporate a little bit more, incorporate more. Again, I would probably go with a three pound weight. So we'll see how many I can get through here. We're gonna go to that little squat and punch. So down, punch right arm forward. Down, left arm forward. Drop and punch drop and punch. So if you increased or added any weight, we should be feeling it, yes? Drop and punch, drop and punch. Two more sets, down, right arm forward, left arm forward, last set. Punch, drop and lift. We have that squat overhead press. So if you increase the weight, and you need to, split that weight between both hands. Lift. Four. Three. Your belly is in. Your hips are pushing back. Two. And one. Now I'm going to keep the weights together here as we go into that bicep curl. Hands are facing in, you can bring them forward and keep that a little more narrow with the arms. Curl and press down, lift. Now try not to swing through the torso here. It is easy to do, so we don't want any swinging. Lift and release. Three, two, and one. Good, we're gonna come into that forward step. Reverse fly here, right arm for eight. Seven. My left arm wants to fly up. My right arm is resisting. You've got four, three, two. We're gonna switch weights, left side. Lift and lower, lift and lower. A little different there, four, Three, two, and one. Back to the right leg forward. 
So you can keep the hand in weight in one hand, one lunge, and that row up. Drop and lift. Other option, down and lift up here. Drop and lift. I have to go forward just a little bit. Four, because the weight can't come all the way down with my front leg. Three, two, and one. Good, switch legs, switch arms, down and lift, down and lift. I'm taking it, my right arm was tired. Lift, drop and lift. All right, give me four, three, two, and one. All right, I'm gonna lose the weight for this next one for those tricep kickbacks. Right arm comes forward. You can take the water bottle, no weights at all. We've got eight, seven, six, five, four. We're squeezing the tricep muscle. Last two, switch legs, keep the arms going back in, back and in. Press in, press in. We've got four, three, two, and one. Excellent. All right, we're gonna go into that back release. You can take the weight again if you choose. You don't have to. You can keep the weight in both hands here if you choose, and we can modify with just the twist through. You don't have to add the punch forward. Your choice. So we're just going to twist across, twist across. Again, if you do not have the hand weight, you might be adding that punch. If you have the hand weight, continue to punch. Four, three, two, switch with the weight if you have it. If not, just keep rotating with me. Eight, seven, six, five, last four, three, two, and one. Four squats down, down, and up. I'm taking the weight into my right hand. Two, and one. We add that in. Eight, seven, you got it. Six, five, four, three, we're gonna go two. Now keep the squat, four in the center. Four, three, we're just gonna switch the weight to the left hand. Here we go, we've got eight, seven, six, five. Nice and strong. Three, two, and one. Good, give the let arms a little shake out, or the legs a little shake out. Now we're gonna go to that punch across. We're gonna do a short set with the weights, and then we're gonna work through our cool down. Again, all of the movements through with no weights. But we gotta make sure we even out the other side because we just did right hand last, right hand with the weight last time. So a little squat, press left arm, right arm, left, right. So if you're using a weight, arms should be pretty tired. Four, three, two, and one. Beautiful, put the weight down. Ooh, a little shake out through the shoulders. We've got this. All right, a quick cool down. Just moving through each of the motions. So a little down, press, down, press. So here it can even be more of just a shake out and not a punch. Four, three, two, and one. Nice, squat, and just reach for the ceiling and stretch. Squat down, reach and stretch. Drop and lift, drop and lift. Good, now we were doing that bicep curl before. All I want you to do here is take the arm forward, stretch out through the wrist and through the forearm. 
So 24 minutes can give you a workout, yes? I felt one. Press. And come up. Good. Just down and up. So we're going to go into that reverse fly. Right leg comes forward. And we're just going to reach up and then cross the arms down. Reach up. Cross the arms down. Reach. And cross one more. Switch legs. Keep the movement going. Lift and release. Lift and release. Two more. Lift and release. Lift and release. Nice. So on that row, we're just going to stretch out. So we were pulling up here. We're just going to take that arm back up and behind. Keep your head lifted. Give yourself a little paddle back. Yes, job well done. Gently switch arms. So I just ask you stick with me. 24 workouts. 24 minutes long. You can do this. Absolutely. Release. Now we're just going to release to the back. Just that small release. Here, I can just swing the arm. But I always want to make sure on this one that my legs and my arm, or my shoulders and my hips are moving in the same direction. Four, three, two, and one. Roll all the way down. Tuck your pelvis and roll all the way up. Down. And lift. Two more. Drop. And lift. Down. And roll up. Excellent job, my friends. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Come back. Get this one done. Come back. You don't have to do them all in order. Make yourself a little checklist. 1 through 24, and then mark off whichever workout it is that you did that day. You all are staying strong. You're working through. I'm so proud of you. I miss you terribly, but we will be together again soon. So until then, bye, friends. <laughs>